Just push through, just push through. You can't push through all the time. Sometimes it's hard. Jesus, just be a fence. Good morning, you guys. It is Wednesday hump day. And it is 7.30. And it's time to get up and get moving. I've already showered and got myself together the mom fit for the day i just got on a tank top some sweatpants and my little slippers the mirror is dirty because your girl munchkin handsy just all kind of handsy i'm about to go downstairs and make myself some tea my first meeting, I think, is at 10 or 10.30. Let me look. 10.30. We went to the little Mexican restaurant that's around here because I just did not feel like cooking. And I'm really considering getting one of those meal prep services. <clears throat> like factor meals or something like that to replace either my lunch or my dinner because I've been, it's been a little bit of a struggle lately just getting things prepared like on Sundays and whatnot. I'd be wanting to meal prep but I'd just be so tired and just wanting to do other things and so I just need to make it a priority but i'm also you know looking for ways to help my life be easier and that's what the purpose of those things are and my company provides a health and wellness benefit so i think i'm gonna take them up on that and like look for a meal prep service that i can have for those days where i'm just exhausted and tired like i always make sure clearly that my daughter eats but for myself, I don't be eating like I should. And with me trying to balance work, life, having uh, some sort of a routine, a schedule for um, going to the gym, I need to get on that. It's like, it's just been a lot, y'all. It's just been a lot. But I'm really working on it and trying my best to figure out what I need to do to help me with that. I want like a house manager or like a nanny or something like not necessarily a nanny but like a house manager I don't know like somebody that can like just do the small things like clean up get like one or two meals going and that be that I don't know if that's something that everyday people do but I be needing I need something girl but anyways y'all I just I am really trying so hard to focus on my peace and doing the very best job that I can do and sometimes you need some recognition. You need, especially from the people that are benefiting directly from your hard work. And when people act ungrateful or try to diminish what you're doing, it can drive you up a wall. And I'm speaking from personal experience. It's driven me up the wall. Um, here recently, like not too long ago, that happened and it's like the nerve but that's why you gotta remove yourself from people like that as far away as you can because that sort of energy will disrupt the good flow that you have going and take you off your game and when you have a lot that you're trying to balance and do, you can't afford to have those sort of folks interrupting your your peace. So, 
that's what time it is for me right now. Um, it's nine o'clock and my plan after we eat, I'm gonna take my daughter over to my parents' house so she can hang out for the day while I get my work done. And um, go from there. I just haven't been feeling my best lately. And I'm really trying to power through. But I'm only a human being. I'm one single human being. I'm just a girl. And I don't want to be the tough one all the time. I'm quite frankly tired of being a tough one. And having to just be in my narrative of just push through, just push through, just push through. can't push through all the time. Sometimes it's hard. I want to live a fulfilling and happy life and one where I don't have many regrets and just be peaceful. That's it. I don't mess with nobody. I literally just stay in my own little bubble, my own little lane. Stay out of the way. I stay out of drama. I try to stay just over here and I tell you for real for real darkness is straight up and down attracted to light it wants to consume it and that's a real thing and you cannot allow yourself to be consumed by darkness because mm -mm. Nope. Anyways, along with picking up my dry cleaning, I need to call the resort where we're staying so I can book like my massage and. But other than that, I will check in with you guys a little bit later on. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Or whatever day it is, wherever you are. See you later. Hey, y'all. <sighs> Baby, listen to me. It's been a day. It has been a day. It's been a day. It's like... What the heck? Like... I'm trying to steady my tripod. But, y'all. I promise you... Your girl is just not... It's been rough, but we've gotten through it. It is almost 5 o'clock. I have... What do I have going on? Um, I'm getting the dogs their dinner going. I just wrapped up work. And when I tell y'all... It's been a lot, it's been a lot going on for me because I, for one, and why does my camera look like it's, so I guess it is, it is mirroring right now. I don't know how that happened, but whatever. Um, I've had a lot to do today because I'm going out for some PTO. One, one second. There were things that I needed to, you know, pass off to my teammate. And that process uh, of going out on PTO is more stressful sometimes than doing your job. It's almost like, you know what? It's too much work to pass off. It's too much work to create the things that you need to pass off. That it's like, you know, I don't even go. I'm not even gonna go. I'm just not gonna even go. Because I gotta prep for the prep to go out. You know what I'm saying? It's like, what is happening? We're doing it. It's done. And that's just it. I... 
I want this to be a relaxing experience for myself because I do so much. Y'all don't understand, I do so freaking much and I do it with a smile. You know, I do it with a smile and I may get frustrated and cry when nobody's looking, but for 99%, 85% of the time, I'm, I'm handling it. You know what I'm saying? I'm handling it because that's what, that's what you do when you're the boss, when you're the HOH, head of household. You know what I'm saying? It's like you got to keep it pushing. But... Players need love too, you know? The big dogs need breaks sometimes. And that's just what I'm feeling at the moment. Hey, you guys. I know it's a different POV right now. We are in the Jeep, but I'm holding y'all on my tripod right now. You can probably tell, maybe not, but it is definitely raining. And it is the day before we're supposed to go to our retreat. And it's supposed to be like this. Hurricane Debbie said, what's that? But it's okay. We're gonna power through and enjoy ourselves regardless. It's gonna be, it's gonna be fun. I, anyway, make sure y'all are focusing. Can you focus on me? <laughs> Anyways, right now I'm heading to the UPS store to return some Amazon packages and thankfully Target is right next to the store we need to put some lotion on my hands is right next to the UPS store so we're going to just pop right over there to get a few more things that I want to have for the car ride the trip some of those things being snacks. Actually, most of those things being like snacks. And I'm gonna see. I have bathing suits because of the fact that I take my daughter to go swimming every Saturday. But, you know, I wanted, you know, just something else. Like, I have a really cute cheetah print one. But I was thinking of finding if I could just something else I'm gonna go to the hot springs I'm gonna do like one of the um, book one of the times to just go sit in the hot springs and get all those good minerals and stuff in my skin and all that so I'm gonna have like a little two piece two piece something other I'm not quite comfortable with my midsection yet so hopefully I can find something that is a little appropriate slash flattering i am also i also booked myself a swedish massage the one that i wanted to get which was a actual body treatment where they exfoliate your whole body and it's called oh, it was called a mineral wrap so they exfoliate your whole body and then they wrap you in like this mineral stuff and then you go and you rinse it all off in one of their mineral showers and then you get rubbed down with this like body cream. I really, really wanted to do that, but they didn't have any space or any opening. So I'm just gonna get a massage. I could definitely use one. Cause like after the drive that we're gonna have to make and just with being a person that is hunched over the computer all the time and carrying a baby, It's a lot. And walking, it's just like, girl, I need it. I don't need to justify nothing, but I just, I know I need it and I'm going to get one. But I'm super excited about it. I definitely canceled the trip because of the weather and I'm like, this is not okay. But the beauty of it is that it's not gonna last the whole weekend. It's just the day that we're going down, it's gonna be rainy, but once, even when we get there, it's not gonna be raining. And so the next day it's gonna be sunny and 75, so it's gonna be perfect and I'm really excited and I just want to make the ride down as comfortable as I can make sure I have all of the things that you could think of I've decided to leave Monet because I feel as though that that's just gonna to be too much on her and on top of that 
the baby does stress her out because my dogs have never been around children babies like their entire lives and they're 12 and 10 or wait how old is marco or 13 and 10 one of those like <laughs> i think that it'll be much good for everyone to <clears throat> excuse me to have like a little break the dogs are gonna hang out with my brother for the weekend lord he's never taken care of four dogs by himself so we're gonna see how that goes y'all back just a hair and let's try to get this tripod in a good spot okay y'all crooked but okay anywho we're home as you can tell i done loaded up everything brought everything in the house got the dogs out for a nice little walk and now i'm about to just go ahead and get started on lunch it's three o'clock and i told you i wanted to make like um some turkey burgers let me just show y'all really quickly some of the things that i got from target these snacks are all the lights on it just seems so gloomy i got this i wanted to bring like just some travel size feminine wash so i got this one here okay more little snacks then i wanted to get these i saw these little stellas like these little Stella, I just want to call these things wine coolers, but I just got them in all the flavors. So I'm going to put them in a cooler to keep in the truck. These will be obviously in the back. Um, or like once we get there. Um, but I got tropical mango, peach, pineapple. I also got these little power crunch strawberry bars for myself shortbread butter cookie bites i also got some more of these little snacks for my daughter these are the mango bites got these also got some actual strawberries because i plan on like packing her like some little snack stacks so that she can have those um, for entertainment in the car for her i got Oh no, I got several books. I got Corduroy. I also got her this Never Touch a Panda. This is a sensory book. I also got the Rainbow Fish. I got her some more little bath toys. These, hold on. I should have waited. Or maybe I can give her this one. I'm just gonna go ahead and just open this one up so she can have it. I got these bubbles here got her this little backpack because you know and I'm gonna put her things for the trip for the road trip in here like her books extra snacks toys things like that there are a few things that she was obviously playing with in the store but I kind of want to get stuff that she doesn't that she does not see every day so that you know she won't be so bored and then I got her these soft blocks to play with in the playpen i'm gonna carry the retractable playpen that i have in my parents house i'm gonna pack that up and then when she's sleeping or just like when we're in the room and she just needs to like be contained for a bit i'm gonna put like her blocks in there so she can play with those more things for the dogs i got them some more treats bully sticks i also got her some more swim diapers then moving on for myself, I got this little thing. This is actually <laughs> Look at that. It's a snack thing. Only been a few hours but it felt like days. Only been days but it felt like months. Only gone for a year, only go like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. I'm 
my newest look like Tyler Perry. But she don't love me, she too scary. My hope is fun like Jackie Brown. Hey, buddy. I wanna know what she too down. Will you be my leading lady? I wanna contract them, no maybe. Okay, y'all. Hi. I'm about to finally sit down and eat. I had breakfast super early this morning at six o'clock and I'm about to eat my second meal. I made a turkey burger and it's missing the lettuce because my Instacart person, they just took an hour to not even get to the store so I had to cancel my order and we're just gonna have, you know, a veggie-less burger. Mm. Still good. Mm. Chanel, will you be my leading lady? I want a culture and get a little baby. In the meantime, it's a little bit. It's the meantime. I don't know if you're doing what you want. Might have been a few hours and it's been like days. Only been days, but it feels like months. Only go for you, only go like once. In the meantime, I'm just not doing what I want. In the meantime, I'm just not doing what I want. In the meantime, I'm just not doing what I want. Hey guys, um, I don't know if I'm just tired or what, but putting together this freaking stroller and I'm Y'all probably can see chocolate chip smudges all over me, but I don't know what happened just now with this freaking stroller, but the instructions, I don't know if it's because I'm tired, just don't feel like doing certain stuff, but it just did not seem intuitive to me, like certain parts of the instructions, like the bolts. They made it seem like the bolts that you're supposed to, to use to secure the handlebars, um, that you're supposed to secure these with were two separate bolts that were supposed to be in the package. So I'm getting ready to light Amazon up, light up Delta Children, just light up everybody because I'm frustrated. I'm like, how y'all gonna put the Allen wrench in there but then not the bolts? You had it all taped down super tough to one of the arms but then there are no bolts attached to it. So I'm like, what is it? So. I just was like, maybe it is these two bolts that is on the side of things. Anyways, long story short, I figured it out. I had to use my teeth as well to kind of pull this thing out. I'm like, girl, what the fuck is happening? Excuse my language, but that's where I was. Everybody was screaming at me. My daughter, the dogs. Like, I'm like, what is happening? I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. Get somebody else to do it. Get somebody else to do it. I don't want to do it. I just, I'm over it. Okay. This thing is put together. Um, it looks like it's gonna do exactly what I need it to do. I'm not even, um, I guess I can because might as well. But this is, this is the freaking, um, oh Lord, now what did I do? So, This is it. This is it. Okay. This is and look a little like some sitting sideways. I don't know, child. Like it don't look like it's bent right or something. <sighs> Jesus, just be a fence. This is the stroller. I wanted something that was a little bit more compact. I don't know if y'all can even see, but this is the stroller right here okay um not gonna talk about assembly because that was just not as 
again to me it wasn't as intuitive i just whatever okay but um it's compact it has a very small little basket down here i no diaper bag is fitting down there so if you're thinking about putting a diaper bag down in that compartment don't think about it so if you just don't do it it could probably fit if you have one of those um packing cubes or just something that is small to contain like items that you can get to or that you just need like some wipes diapers a bottle maybe and maybe like a book or a toy and kind of squeeze in there maybe if you are a woman with that carries a bag i'm gonna get her backpack real quick this is her backpack that i got from target today it's for children y'all can kind of see how small it is i'll put it on keep in mind for reference i'm five feet so this is this is how it looks on me but that can fit down there if you kind of stuff it in there that's all that can fit okay you're not getting to it quick don't be trying to snatch something out fast because it's not happening and it has a little cup holder thing right here don't think about putting your stanley in here it's not happening this is not even a stanley but i'm letting you know for reference it ain't gonna fit this is it this is the jeep adventure glide stroller i got <clears throat> because this just occupied so much time in my life right now i'm gonna go ahead and put this bad boy in the truck so i can get it out of my face myself I don't know. Leave me here, I'll fuck myself. See me in the mirror, I duck myself. Don't need much, I'll fuck my wealth. Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends, but you know that I do not depend on nothing or no one. Why would you show up so uninvited? Just change my mind like that. Please don't take.